Baker, the man perhaps most associated with the role of Doctor Who, has been in the headlines today with the fantastic news that he's returned to the long-running BBC science fiction show. The fourth Doctor actor has reprised his role for the new Doctor Who release, Shada, which sees an unfinished story from the 1970s completed with hand-drawn animation. It's available on DVD and Blu-ray next month. But did you know that Tom once wrote a Doctor Who film that was within months of being made? Here's everything you need to know about the unmade, scary, but funny, big screen adventure for the Time Lord. The story itself would have seen the fourth Doctor, as played by Baker, take a trip to Scotland with companions Sarah Jane and Harry Sullivan, played by their television actors Elizabeth Sladen and Ian Martyr respectively. There, horrifying scarecrows came to life and terrorized a small community. Cybors, who were definitely not Cybermen cough, appeared, as did the Daleks leading to a climactic giant pinball confrontation and cricket showdown. Doctor Who meets Scratchman began life in 1974, just as Tom Baker started his still-unbeaten reign as the Gallifreyan. During breaks and rehearsals for Doctor Who, he and co-star Martyr decided they themselves would pen an adventure for the Time Lord and his companions. Once they'd scribbled their ideas down, the pair took the synopsis to the program's makers. According to Baker, the BBC hated it, but the men would not be deterred. If BBC One wouldn't take Scratchman, then perhaps cinemas would, influenced by the success of the 60s Dalek movies, starring screen legend Peter Cushing as Doctor Who, Martyr, pictured below, once stated that the big screen transition was all Tom's idea as was the story itself. Within a year, director James Hill, an Oscar-winning documentarian also known for the film Born Free and 60s TV shows The Saint and The Avengers, became involved and the trio completed a script after a holiday to Italy together. The gang took Scratchman to BBC Enterprises, now known as BBC Worldwide, and pitched their Doctor Who movie. The commercial arm of the UK institution were very keen and began to draw up various contracts, setting production to start in 1977. This was the first point where Baker would have time off from filming Who on television. Emboldened by their script, the story's denouement was left open-ended with a possible return for the malignant enemy in a sequel. Scotland and Lanzarote were penciled in for the shoot with the latter doubling as a volcanic wasteland. The location has since been used by the show in 1984's Planet of Fire and 2014's Kill the Moon. And popular horror actor, Vincent Price, pictured below, was attached to play the titular villain.